Hey guys, it's me Juan again. Um, it's gonna be one of my videos. Um, it's gonna be really quick. I'm just gonna show my quick Burberry collection. I actually started this and then um, <clears throat> ended up buying a or seeing a couple of Louis Vuitton belts and fell in love with them. So I decided to switch over to Louis Vuitton. So um, this is kind of a three-piece collection that I ended up just um, not giving up on, but I'm gonna pursue my Louis collection instead. Um, Occasionally, I probably will post up new Burberry pickups. Um, I still do like their ties. Um, some of their wallets are pretty cool. I actually prefer the Burberry wallets over the Louis Vuitton wallets personally, so I should have more pickups. But um, I'm going to start into it with um, this first piece. It's actually a Christmas present from this past December. Um, came with, um, well, Jeez, let me try this again. Basically, it came with these two things. Um, you know, there was this kind of just holds this in, which is pretty cool. It slides on out. Um, the box, as you saw, um, it's a dust bag. <clears throat> this is actually my everyday wallet right now. Um, it's uh, as you can see, it's taken a little bit of abuse on the leather there, but you know, just because it's such a thick piece of leather that it's you know. Um, There's a small stain right here that I haven't had a chance to clean yet, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, so Burberry, um, it has two billfolds, and on the inside, um, there's like a Burberry logo. Um, it's a little bit bigger. This is a wallet I used in high school. From Coach. And, um... I feel the coach one's a little longer, as you can, as you can see, it's a little bit longer. But this one's just um, the Burberry one is a little bit wider and thicker, which I like. I prefer my Burberry one, obviously, over the coach one. I just have the coach one there in case um, for some reason I lose this wallet or it rips or I just you know in case emergency happens. But overall, I, I'm in love with this wallet. I want to thank my sister and my cousin for hooking it up. Small gift for Christmas. Appreciate it. It sees a lot of use. Um, and then it's in pretty good condition because I never sit on it when I'm driving or eating or something. I always pull it out of my front pocket or leave it in the center console. This was actually a pickup I got a few weeks ago um, when I picked up that um, the Damier graffiti belt. I don't know if I posted a video on here or not yet, which I probably haven't. There's one on YouTube, but it's not really good quality. So I'll probably end up... Um, posting a new video of that, and um, I bought it the same day I bought this, um, let's see if can get you to see that top part, um, what I do like about these belts is they do feel pretty similar to Louis as far as the material goes, um, leather is really good, I like the buckle on here, um, and these are literally half the price of the Louis Vuitton pieces, so, um, here's some of the, like, well, this just came on here, so I guess you could hang it up if you really wanted to. And then, um, here's, like, the Burberry tag with, um, like, the sizing and stuff. Sorry, guys. On YouTube, I guess the camera's, like, backwards or something versus my regular setup. Um, just basically tells you that, like, the night and all that stuff and the checker pattern are... Um, they belong to Burberry and whatnot, so all these people with knockoffs, shame. Um, okay, the belt came out to 225 before taxes, so in California that brought us to about 260 something or some 40. I don't know. Tax is like 10%, so about 250 or something. I, I don't want to do the math right now. Sorry guys, here's um the dust bag. Um, one thing I will note is that I do prefer the Louis Vuitton. Um, the uh, Handles, these just feel kind of skimpy and kind of, you know, like they're going to really break on you, whereas Louis Vuitton are a thick rope material. Um, oh, and my glasses are Burberry. Okay, so without further ado, here's my Burberry Nova print belt, or not, no, I don't know if it's really a Nova print because it's that dark chocolate, I don't know if the Nova print is pretty much just a white, that, that creamy one, sorry. But, um, here it is. 
you can see. Hold on, let me try to. This is kind of sorry, guys. Once again, I just, like I said, it's just the way the camera is, but here it is. And, um, let's see. I never really do a Burberry review, so I don't know what to look for as far as a Burberry belt goes, but I'm going to pretend like this is my Burberry. Size 3690, made in Italy. It's a Burberry stamp, and I don't really see a serial number on here like I do with my Louis piece, so maybe they don't include serial numbers. But, excellent sewing. I like the brown and the black. It goes beautifully. I'm actually really considering picking up one of their wallets to match, um, maybe even one of their duffel bags versus a Louis Vuitton key ball. Just because I don't see myself using the key ball, or actually any duffel bag, for more than like once or twice a year. I don't know if I can justify spending $1,400 on a Louis Vuitton key ball when I can just go to Burberry and pick one up for 800 and use those 600 bucks toward belts like a Hermes belt or 600 bucks toward something else, clothes or something. I don't know. I'm still kind of really thinking about that. The only way I can really justify buying a key ball is if I buy um, a pre owned one. Um, or if I can um, catch someone with a deal, or if I just buy the key ball 50 that doesn't have the um, the shoulder strap, so it's just like a duffel bag. But I, I feel like at that point I'd be carrying a purse, which I'm not really down for. So just to recap, here's the belt, just the wallet, and then the glasses. That's really all I have for Burberry. I mean, I didn't really get a chance to go into it too deep, you know, but, um, yeah, that's my, uh, small collection, um, I can't promise that I'm actually going to pursue it anymore, because I like Louis Vuitton a lot better, um, but we'll see, um, so if you haven't added me yet, um, this is my Tumblr, uh, descriptions in the bottom link, it's, uh, www.damiefan.tumblr.com, um, damie is spelled D-A-M-I-E-R, and then obviously fan is F-A-N, tumblr.com <clears throat> if you're actually on my tumblr now um and you just want to go to my youtube because obviously i always post on youtube before i come through here um it's uh it's mustang man 07 um capital m's and then it's all one just one piece no underscore no dash nothing just mustang man 07 um so please comment rate uh we can't well yeah, just comment thumbs up you know all that good stuff um and i'll be posting up a few more videos today of my <clears throat> recent pickups um, so have a good one guys.